It's not the same as the Mega Millions or the Powerball, but we do have the 4-degree guarantee coming up. See if we add it on to that jackpot in just a couple minutes. Uh, first up, as you can see, we're going to stay quiet leading into the middle of the week. Uh, in fact, the majority of this week could end up seeing lots of tranquil weather. One exception, possibly tomorrow night, a few storms rumbling through. We'll also see the humidity on the rise. may not be quite as comfortable as the past couple days, but uh, overall we are looking at a lot of calm weather ahead, just like we saw as of today. We can thank that high pressure that's been in place since yesterday for that. That's going to keep us clear and dry going into tomorrow, but it's drifted past us at this point, so that's going to allow uh, some southerly winds, bringing back a little heat and humidity into the region. And eventually this next weather system catches up with us. That's the source of possible rain and storms going into tomorrow night. Thankfully, though, we are on the outside looking in of any kind of severe weather that looks to take place across a lot of Ohio and Indiana. Chicago, again, right on the fringe here, and they've been hit hard the last couple weeks uh, with severe weather. Thankfully for us, though, again, we're on the edge of all that, so we don't have to worry about necessarily any kind of severe storms uh, in the near-term outlook. Tonight, it's quiet, down into the mid-50s like we saw as of last night. Tomorrow, a couple degrees warmer than today. Uh, we'll be back to the mid-80s for most spots under mostly sunny sky. Many locations fell just short of 80 degrees again, so you probably start to feel a little more like July once we get into tomorrow afternoon. Light breeze out of the southeast. And again, the humidity does go up just a little bit, but still looking at pleasant conditions to be outdoors. Definitely have the sunscreen handy if you haven't uh, gotten to that habit yet this summer. Allergen levels and air quality remaining at uh, pretty decent levels, so we don't have to worry about that going into tomorrow afternoon. Then for tomorrow night, as you can see, some showers and storms approaching. Not a ton of rain coming so we're not going to pick up much. You can see by about 5 o'clock Thursday morning, some light showers in the region. And that should be about it. So it'll be pretty quiet throughout Thursday itself with mainly sunny conditions as we could see storms down the road from us. As we look ahead in the forecast, lower humidity and slightly lower heat for Friday and Saturday. Our best chance for rain looks to be Sunday into Monday with some scattered showers and storms. And then in your most accurate 10 day forecast, we have plenty of heat starting Tuesday. You could see several days in a row in the 90s with a lot of humidity. So definitely feeling that uh, summer heat wave potentially into next week. Now in the four degree guarantee, hit the bullseye today. That means cash total up to 169. Hoping to add on to that. Probably won't get to a billion anytime soon, but you know, we're trying. Hey, 169 bucks. I don't think anyone's complaining with that, Alex. Thanks.